Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. Actually, I'm going to be filming a couple today, but, and it's a $1.25. Oh, there's Alex. A $1.25 haul now. My stores have all increased in the area that I've been to. So it was nice while it lasted, but all right, let's get into it. So I found at my store, and this is not a big haul, some cereal. Sarah loves this stuff. This is Space Jam, A New Legacy. Berry with marshmallows, and it's uh, Space Jam. So, and there is, this is an 11.2 ounce box, limited edition, whatever that means. And the good through date is April 23rd. So she's got plenty of time and good old LeBron James. So I got that for Sarah. And then I found her a box of Hershey Kisses cereal. And look, they're shaped like Hershey Kisses. How sweet. This is a 10.9 ounce box. And the Best Buy is uh, May 18th of 2022. Hi, Alex. Hi, baby. Did you want to say hi? Here, you can just stand up. You can just stand up and say hi, everybody. There. Okay, go lay down. Okay, so cereal. I don't think I have a lot of food. Um, I did grab some rubber gloves. I can't remember if these are the ones that I fit, fit me good as a large. Um, but we're going to see because I've got some work to do. Yep, those are okay. So... I don't have a huge hand, but I guess it's big enough. But this is the large. You'll see a lot of cleaning product because I have some projects coming up. I was given some cast iron skillets that have some rust on them. Not terribly bad, but they need to be seasoned. So I got stuff for that in one of these hauls. Um, for some friend mail, I just got some of this craft paper. I like to wrap boxes when I'm shipping them. And that, and they, I saw this in the 3M brand. This is the Jot, and it's a 40-pound roll. So I think that's 40-pound is the weight of the paper. And it's 13 feet, and it's just brown craft paper, which I, use, I like to do that, use that for lots of things. Okay. Um, I Receipts. Thank you all who joined Fetch. I hope you're enjoying um, Fetch is an app that I use and you scan your receipts and you get money and I'm getting ready to cash in again. Uh, you can cash in with as little as $3 and you get points for every receipt you scan. If you click in my link below, you'll get like free 2,000 or 3,000 points or something like that. But I like to share. Um, I grabbed this colored basket for Sarah for Easter. I like to give her Easter baskets. Um, that she can utilize in her craft room or whatever. I was hoping for pink. I didn't find it, but teal is fun too. She can also store pens in here, makeup, whatever. But I'll put all her Easter stuff in that for her. So I grabbed that. Um, I grabbed this as pink chenille. I'm going to be doing a DIY. And I grabbed a couple things in this haul that I will show you if you want to do it too. And it involves the... Um, the bunny head metal wire frame and not deco mesh. So I grabbed some of this in pink. I think I have white around here somewhere. OMG, wait till you see this guys. If you're a plant person, these are, I'm gonna show you the lizard. They're two different ones. They've got a frog and a lizard. And what they do is if you're doing like tomatoes or have a vine, you can, um, have it hug with its arms and legs and it will hold your plant and it's a two pack come on guys tell me that is not to die for that is adorable and well worth a dollar 25 as far as i'm concerned i think this is adorable and i cannot wait to use it i do have some plants that i need to um kind of close together so i grabbed that for myself um, oh, I found some more hair masks. This is also from the Hask brand, which is a nice brand. I picked up the ones that were like the roses or the, the roses, the wines. These are yogurt based. So we have hydrating, deep conditioning, Greek yogurt with fig honey. 
So, and there's a lot in here for my hair. This is definitely two or three masks. So I grabbed this one for me. And for Sarah's Easter basket, I got her this deep conditioning and repairing. It's for like color treated hair. But I think these are great if you don't wanna give a bunch of candy for your Easter. Like stuff like this for your tween, teens, millennials, young adults, old adults, because I use it. I just think these things are fun in Easter baskets. So I grabbed those for her. Let's see. Oh, I got a couple more bags here. Let's get them pulled out and then I can move back. Okay. I found women's gold toe compression socks. Now I don't wear these on the regular and they are regularly $12 a pair. Um, but I will tell you, I got them in this pattern and then I got them in this white with just some rainbow stripes and I did try them on. I wear uh, eight and a half to a nine and the length is exactly perfect on my feet. And then they fit right up to my knees. These are like for my legs, the perfect fit. And I have a pretty beefy calf. They're very muscular from all my bicycling. Um, I use these a lot when I work on my feet at the Schottenstein Center or the shoe. Like I might wear these tonight because I think, let me, I'm gonna take them out of its packaging because I think the black will go up high enough. Yes. So for me, the black, just my pants have to cover it. So I'm probably gonna wear these tonight. I love wearing them when I'm going to be on my feet. It just feels so revitalized. So I grabbed those because I'm like a dollar twenty-five for a pair of compression socks that is normally like um, twelve dollars. Was a good deal. They had a lot of men's socks. I just don't have a need. Ugh. Guys, I'm going to be getting my hair cut. I like the length. I'm going to get layers up here. This is all getting a little too heavy. Just want to throw that out there. Okay, and I have these in a couple different hauls, but they're like, the ow, that staple just got me. They're exactly like the pom-poms, I mean the snowballs, <laughs> but they're for Easter. They're calling them pom-poms now, Easter, with the Easter stuff. So I got a couple 18 packs and a couple 24 packs, and I'm going to use these and this and some other things. For my DIY, Alex is digging in his toy basket. I also will probably give him one of these because he really likes the balls that he could put in his teeth and carry around the house. But these are great, even just for like a bunny tail. Obviously, you can use these any season. And if you have leftovers from the Christmas stuff, I say use those. Um, if not, you can buy new ones, right? I'm just trying to figure out what I'm doing here. Okay, what's next? Oh, look at that fun color for Easter. It's just the drying mat. We've talked about these a million times. I use this size under my um, Keurig to kick up any spills of coffee or whatever, so it doesn't get on my counter. And it also makes it easier to slide my Keurig in and out under the counter. And I love this color. It's like a nice mint, but not overly, it's coming off gray, but it's, let's see back here. It's a mint green, but it's like a muted mint, which I really enjoy. And it's, we see these all the time and I pick them up fairly regularly. Uh, for my brother, I found another one of these Gildan golf shirts. This is a 5X, so it will fit him. And I need to take this with me. I'm going to be working it up. He works at the Schottenstein Center where I work tonight, so I'll bring him this one. And I also have a gray one that I can take him. Um, yeah, but these are great for him for summer and for a dollar twenty-five, just to bum around in. I think that's a good deal. And if you've ever had to get clothes for a larger person, you know it's not always easy and it's expensive. Oh, another receipt. Oh, and here's the white that I got as well. I love this chenille um, a lot. It's fun in crafting and all different kinds of crafting. But for Easter, I was thinking that that's cute. Also for babies, but it's so squishy and soft. So I have an idea to use those. So we'll see how that works out for us. 
just a couple more things. My store's got a fair amount of stuff, but not a ton of stuff, if that makes sense. Oh, I did get one pair of the men's gold toe. They're pink flamingos. And my brother, uh, air freshener brother, Jay, Sarah's dad, just moved to Myrtle Beach. So I'm going to put these in his Christmas present uh, when I ship it down to them and he can have some gold toe men's flamingo socks, which it's time for me to start thinking about Christmas, guys. I know. I know. Um, oh, <laughs> for Sarah, for Easter, she loves the Disney princesses and she'll be so excited. I think that's Pocahontas back there. No, Moana. Yeah, it's Moana and um, Cinderella and Sleeping Beauty. But it's just a nightlight, and I just thought it would be cute in her Easter basket. <laughs> Alex, buddy. Hi. He said, don't touch my tail, lady. So I grabbed that. They had them in all different, too. Boys, girls. I mean, I, I hate to classify boy, girl. They had Marvel. They had Disney. They had Mickey Mouse. And I think they had Trolls as well. So I grabbed her that. It's just going to go in her Easter basket as a as a funny little ha-ha. And I found fresh apple. Some people didn't like this. I like it. I don't have an issue. I you currently using the peppermint. Mm, it smells like a Jolly Rancher. The green Jolly Rancher is what this smells like. So I grabbed one more for me. Um, I like its moisturizing quality. I'm not sure about this probiotic business, but whatever. Um, hand soap is hand soap and we always need it. And then to do my um, cast iron skillets, I've got three. So I did grab some stainless steel scrubbies and I grabbed some Brillo. I just need to, um, the process I saw says that I need to douse it and soak it in a equal parts vinegar water solution to kind of neutralize the rust. And then I need to scrub it really well, oil it, bake it, oil it, bake it, oil it, bake it. So that's on the agenda for some time next week. But I needed gloves and I don't really have ab abrasive stuff because I've never, I do have one small cast iron skillet, but it's, um, it doesn't, I mean, it's, it's not a good one. I now I have a good size one. So I can bring you along and show you how I clean it if you'd like, but y'all probably know more than I do. I also have a gas a glass top stove so there's that also this summer let me know if you want to come along with my shenanigans I'm going to be getting a new air conditioner and furnace that's exciting right okay they have these and these are just there's a stack of little bunny feet and I saw there's 10 of them in here but I saw somebody do a wreath and they put the bunny feet like it's I guess it would be this way, bunny feet with a tail, like the bunny is black, the back of the bunny. And you can do them this way, but they did two bunny feet and a big fluffy tail on a white wreath. And then had some ears, and I thought that was cute too. And I do have two of the bunny heads, so I can do one facing front, and I can do one maybe from the back side and put one outside, one inside. I don't know. We'll see. And then the last thing I got in this haul is this shirt. It's also from Gildan. Now it is an extra large and typically I buy two extra large t-shirts, but I have lost since the 1st of November, 27 pounds, but I still am carrying my weight in the middle. So we'll see. I just want to try one and see if I could wear this in an extra large. And I love, it's a heathered orange and yellow. I don't know if you can see the yellow in there, but it's a really pretty summer shirt just to wear around the house again. And for $1.25, if it doesn't work for me, I will 100% donate it to somebody else who can fit or I'll keep it. And maybe this can be my gold shirt that I want to be able to put this on. I don't know. I don't know. But that was everything. That's a very quick haul this week. Um, I do have more stuff, but I'm going to break it up into two hauls because I think it will be too much for one. But yes, yeah, so leave me some comments down below of some ideas that you would like to see some videos of. I'm trying to kind of 
broaden my horizons this year, do some different shopping hauls, do some um, different types of videos, some more crafty stuff, cooking, all of that if you're interested. Also, I have a Shein, S-H-E-I-N. It's a clothing line that you buy online. I ordered a haul. Oh, I ordered a haul. I ordered four summer shirts from them and I ordered or spring, summer, and then I ordered also from them some other little bits. So that haul will be coming up in a couple weeks. It's not scheduled to be delivered to my house until February 26th. So it'll be probably the beginning of March, which I will have, I have several hauls planned of cl spring clothing shopping for the beginning of March. Um, my anniversary at the bank, my 10 year anniversary is in March and we get points that we can use on this online shop. And one of the gift cards I could get is to TJ Maxx and Marshalls and Home Goods. So I'm gonna get a gift card and go spend it with you guys. And we may do some like in the in the dressing room try on videos where I'm gonna try on some spring stuff. Cause I do need some fresh spring clothes. So there's that, Alex, come here. You come here, we say bye. Oh, this is my big end. Somebody said, girl, he's not that big. Are you kidding me? He weighs like 18 pounds. He is that big. He just doesn't look that big big boned <laughs> and Wellington or well, you don't see him but he's right over here asleep in his basket all right guys I hope you enjoy and you have a great one I'll talk to you later bye say bye you say bye you say bye he said no bye <laughs>